John McEnroe hit back as the ATP confirmed it would be staging a tournament in Saudi Arabia with the WTA expected to follow. John McEnroe has taken a shot at the U.S. government as he spoke out against tennis moving into Saudi Arabia. The ATP announced that the next-gen finals would be staged in Jeddah on a five-year deal while there are rumors the WTA is fielding an offer to hold their year-end finals in Riyadh. And Chris Ever joined McEnroe's calls to stop tournaments going to Saudi. Tennis is officially becoming part of Saudi Arabia's sporting takeover. Following in the footsteps of football and golf. On Thursday, the ATP confirmed that the 21 and under next-gen finals would be moving to Jeddah until 2028. Sports Illustrated has also reported that the WTA finals could move to Riyadh, meaning the top eight players of the year would be competing for the season-ending crown in Saudi Arabia. And McEnroe has officially had his say, noting that sports shouldn't be criticized for moving to the nation when the U.S. government had dealings with Saudi. This is something that's being bandied about obviously since golf did this, the seven-time major winner said at an ESPN event. But a lot of the people are hypocrites that sit around and say that golf or tennis shouldn't go there while tons of businesses and tons of these people that you know about, including our government and many, many others, go there and do business. But all of a sudden it's outrageous that sports athletes do it. Dot. While the former world no one didn't agree with any criticism that athletes would face if they chose to compete in Saudi Arabia, McEnroe still thought that the tennis tours didn't need to stage events in the nation. He continued, Having said that, I wouldn't do it. I don't think our sport needs it. I don't think it would benefit from it, and I don't think we should do it, personally. The American also echoed the words of Everett, who said she wouldn't play in Saudi Arabia but acknowledged that it wasn't their decision. McEnroe added, but as, ever, said, it's not up to us. Someone else is going to make that, decision. They're talking about the next gen finals going there, 21 and under. This is just something that I don't understand why we're going in that direction. While the ATP's move into Saudi Arabia currently only affects the top eight players aged 21 and under, the WTA could send its top stars to the nation. According to recent reports, Riyadh is among the potential host cities bidding to stage the season-ending championships alongside Prague and D.C. And Everett was firm in her stance that the WTA shouldn't hold a tournament in Saudi. I mean, for me, I would prefer not to go to Saudi Arabia to play the WTA finals, she said. Not that I'm going to go play, but for me, I would prefer the WTA not go to Saudi Arabia. Obviously they have the human rights issues and everything, just the way they treat women. I would be against it. But I don't have a vote.